Mic check. Okay. <laughs> Good morning, staff. Mr. Belmore, Ms. Gutzi, Mr. Teixeira, special guests, parents, and the class of 2017. My name is Frances Hernandez, and I'm delighted to represent my fellow graduates in this wonderful celebration. DMCI is what I see when I look out in this room. In the faces of everyone, in which I see the brightest students, I see potential, I see optimism, I see greatness. Through hard work and passion, I firmly believe that we will become whatever we want to be because we have the ability to. We are DMCI and this is our time now. We can all agree that high school is like a roller coaster. Sometimes we want to back out and sometimes we just want to go on the ride just to get it over with. The feeling of the first drop gets the adrenaline rushing in and then we come upon another realization. This is not the last one, that there are more hills that we have to get over with. With every twist, with every turn, and with every change of speed, we are holding on tightly. We scream and we laugh, we make valuable memories to look back on. And then we come to a stop. That is the moment when we realize that everything, that there is always an end to every beginning. Today is the most anticipated day of the whole school career. We have been looking forward to this day since we were children. Since life gets hectic sometimes, let's take the time to be here in this moment, right here, right now. We need to remind ourselves that there is no point of worrying, either about the past or the future, because it is an abstract construction of our own minds. It is no longer real and not yet real. In all seriousness, all we have is the present. All we have is today. And today, we say goodbye to everything that we are familiar with from the last three years of our lives. We are so proud to be a part of a school that is both diverse and inclusive. To go to a school that has many things to offer, this is where our, all our hidden and individual talents develop through the countless hours and efforts of teachers and students. When we think of DMCI, we may be reminded of Mr. Dyer's eyes lighting up as he says, Then you'll get a visit from Dr. Payne, and everyone listens to Dr. Payne. Or the laughter that we hear down the halls when our friends are laughing or yelling our name. The sound of the clicking heels, the jingling keys, the chattering of the radio when we were trying to hire the staff who is on hallway duty. The complaints of many teachers when students volunteered them for pep rally games. Ms. Ruby. When we look back, DMCI will simply be a mirror of our development. DMCI is full of supportive teachers who became close to our hearts. Teachers, you all have opened our minds to be wise and taught us lessons that we will carry wherever life leads us. We are blessed to be surrounded by these hardworking teachers whose priority is not only our education, but our mental health too. I remember one time, I was just so overwhelmed with everything. Then this amazing teacher, she um, took me aside and asked, Francis, are you okay? Do you need to talk? And I was like, no, it's okay, you have to teach. And then she replied, Francis, your mental health comes first. So thank you, Ms. Strong. And we all have been in that kind of situation. And then we did have that support that we needed this year. So thank you greatly to all the staff who cared about us, who listened to our problems and guided us. Thank you for not ignoring our health and simply being there for us. We learned that we truly are never alone. You all deserve our most earnest gratitude and sincere thanks. Graduates, you are surrounded by dreamers and achievers. As much as it is a shock, we will be in each other's hearts and minds. We are the people who laugh together, who cry together. We were there for each other, drama after drama, test after test. We learned together, we grew together, we made and lost friends to together, and maybe even found a love or two. We had great times and it made us grow. It shaped us to be the people we are today. Our experiences give meaning to the all-nighters we pulled, the bitter coffees we drowned in, the tears we shed, and the quick naps in class. We all made DMCI a home for us. 
We became a family, for we really are the Maroons, the individual breaks that are stronger went together. Remember pep rally when we all wore black and had glow sticks? We looked like we were going to some kind of a rave. Or this year's gym riot when we handed out printed L's and salt packets and kind of cheated. Don't forget about the panic that was in the air when the AP exams and provincial exams were upon us. The many teams that made it to the provincial competition and carried on DMCI's reputation. What about the failed senior prank that slipped out of our hands? What about senior skip day at Grand Beach where we suffered under the heat of 30 degrees? Together, we have so many memories to cherish. And wherever we may go, wherever we may become, we will always remember this school for uniting us. We've made it this far and it was all worth it. Let us all be united on marking today as a day of challenge, to aim higher, to work harder, and to excel. I want to let you all know to do whatever it takes to expand your horizons and to meet new opportunities. Don't feel forced to go to school. Remember that education is not a gun to our heads, but it is in our hands, for success depends on how we use that knowledge. Explore your options, see the world, visit the ruins of the Roman Empire, and stand at ground zero. Let these legacies inspire you. Know that sometimes you need to break to rebuild and become better. We must remember that through dreams and many failures, masterpieces in this world were created. Go that extra mile with unwavering determination because that pain will be useful and will be worth it. Look at where we are now. To our parents, we would like to thank you so much for guiding us, for your steadfast love, and for your nonstop support throughout our lives. Thank you all for staying with us, for this may be our toughest journey yet. We are all grateful for everything. Thank you graduates for giving a whole nother meaning to friendship, love, and high school. On behalf of class of 2017, we just want to thank you all again. We just hope that Daniel McIntyre Collegiate remembers us fondly as we'll remember it. We made it, we're here, and we're moving on. Thank you.